Yeah, it's me again. I know you know that uh, I'm not trying to win any popularity contest. If you've watched my videos, which you probably haven't. Not all of them, they're really boring. <clears throat> so to add to the, uh, the worldwide fame that I'm obviously seeking, right? <clears throat> Here's another one for you. <clears throat> Pardon me. People, human beings that do not fear God in the context, within the context, in the context of their own family, tribe, clan, nation, nation not meaning a, a political border, nation meaning, as the Latin would of course indicate, uh, having to do with birth, you know. People that do not fear God within the context of their own family deserve to be ruled over by politicians, priests, and popes, and God forbid females. But <clears throat> So, by fear God, what do I mean? Of course, there are many gods, but there's a little rabbi from Nazareth, kind of uh, thought to be well-known by many people, but probably not actually that well-known. <clears throat> me again and actually not known at all by many many people he said uh, you know love your enemies pray for those that persecute you so the fear of God is clean <clears throat> it's gonna be windy out here and it endures forever I'm getting off track here but <clears throat> this little teacher guy that's what he said love your enemies so a man or a woman in the context of their own family who is able to put aside their own desires and uh, love their enemy, the person that's persecuting them, you know, calling them names, whatever the case is, try to overcome evil with good and they're worthy of some respect because <clears throat> they're doing what not many other people would do obviously and what's needed, not, not what they want to do. So <clears throat> people that choose not to do that and they bicker and fight and get in all kinds of crap and junk <clears throat> they obviously are not worthy of respect their position might demand respect but their actions do not <clears throat> so obviously this puts more responsibility on a man of a you know a husband man of the house head of a household head of a tribe head of a clan etc etc so <clears throat> with that responsibility those that are lining up under his authority, his ability to build them up in that tribe, clan, family. <clears throat> they should be offering up prayers to God for such a person and not trying to rebel or cause problems or do their own thing if they want to have the benefits of being built up into that tribe or clan or family. All the benefits that come with it. All right, and what's more... <clears throat> just as a tag on on the end of this a lot of people will say and you know it's scientifically proven you shouldn't marry your cousin and all this stuff well <clears throat> pardon me again there is a tribe maybe you've heard of them and they're kind of large nowadays and I think they have a geographical area named after them and this tribe <clears throat> was produced by cousins marrying cousins you might have heard of them. Uh, maybe. Maybe in the, even in the news. Israel? Could it be? So, thinking people enjoy thinking. <clears throat>